Hey, my name is Jim Curlin. I'm the president and CEO of Beyond Vision. And I'm proud to welcome you all to the Visibility Center uh, kickoff celebration. It means so much to Beyond Vision's future and growth and our opportunity to grow more jobs and career paths for people who are blind. And we were out of space. We couldn't grow the business anymore, and therefore we couldn't grow jobs and opportunities. Our criteria was we wanted it within five or so miles of our old facility because all of our employees live nearby, right? So having good access to public transportation, a facility that's large enough within five miles of the old place and not a brownfield is a really hard thing to find. And this site became available. We took ownership in 2019 and then started our construction in 2021, roughly. Sure, someone can help me in a regular office space, but it's so much better to be able to do it myself, right? And to come in and do our workout room that's completely accessible, to the locker rooms with the tactile locks, um, the ability to just work at a place that is just designed to make it easier uh, and take away some of the challenges of life, that's just a real privilege. Even a dog grooming room uh, so that people with guide dogs can groom their dog or, or pet. So this kind of tries to simulate what the different types of blindness are. Glaucoma, cataracts, retinitis pigmentosa, or blood vessels in your retina. The facility is 130,000 square feet, um, and it, that's roughly twice as much as what we have in the three current facilities. It's spacious. We have, we have more space than what we worked with in the past. We now have space to grow and expand and dream of a future where even more opportunities will be possible. More has been phenomenal. I mean, here, here, here's how it is to work with more construction. We finished the project on schedule and on budget with everything we wanted in the facility. So they were awesome. This building and this project will have lasting impact on this generation and future generations. So I thank you all for being part of our present tonight, and I hope that all of you will come with us into that exciting future.